to my Sunday segmented vlog. My Sunday segmented vlog, which is going to be three segments today. Three separate ones. One, first one, in the morning, well, early afternoon, it's 13, 40 hours right now. Second one would be midday. Third one would be evening, wrapping up. But that's the idea. There you go. Now, another like real videos I want to do. Get right there. It's uh, my sharpening uh, kit, the toolbox, and I'm going to do a video, complete video on sharpening, how to sharpen a Bowie knife. And other knives, I guess, too, but mainly Bowie on deck. But a few more things still on deck today. I'm going to put the finishing touches on my new uh, logo I've designed for American Bowie Knife Fighting. Got to make the shirts, the training shirts. Uh, it's got some lettering to do and a few little works on it, but I already have the main uh, logo done already and been waiting and working on it for months. So that's the other very important thing on deck for today. I'm gonna bring my mother food shopping. Yay! lawnmower works. I have to put a couple of grass today, but if something happened to it last time I used it, it went poof! A bunch of smoke came out of it, and I, I couldn't start it again. I'm hoping it just seized or something, and after a few days, maybe it'll start right up. That'll make me happy. Because I have nothing I hate more than the grass when it's all like this. And it feels like I need a haircut. I look at the long grass and it feels like my hair is long. It bugs me. It really does. I'm not bullshitting. So it's like a small little torture to have to look at it every day and not be able to cut it. For me, anyway. I'm definitely gonna uh, do work some time on my sets because I always have to practice. Trying to get better, I get better. And I've got a bunch of uh, thinking, serious thinking I've got to do today. I've got to close out a few files, if you will, in my mind, things and open up a couple new ones, and that's about it, you see anything else I can cram into this day, oh, if I gotta go to the store, myself, regular, regular store, uh, no gym today, do a lot, do a lot, and I know there's something bigger uh, I'm forgetting. But that's right, because this is going to be a segment vlog. And if I remember it, I'll, I'll say it later again in my the next segment. Phone ringers turned off, as usual. Beautiful, perfect Sunday. I don't want any fucking people fucking it up on me. Not with any stupid phone calls or stupid inquiries or anything like that. No, not available 24 7 to people, everyone, all the time. And they feel like, except my kids, that they can just reach out and touch me and stuff like that. No. But alright, we're trying not to get too heavy today. Keep it light internally as well. 
soreness, overall soreness, so I'm starting to train again, is uh, getting better, more tolerable for this week. And I can pull my neck around a little bit more, it's not, it doesn't hurt as much. But it's sore, so that's good. So I'll be able to do things right in the gym. Uh, Could rattle off right now, I think, from my, my to do list and uh, things for Sunday. Let's see where it goes, say 12 hours from now, you know, or 10 hours from now, you know, by midnight or something. Let's see where I get done. The main thing I have to get done, I want to get the number one thing. If I don't do anything today and I only get one thing accomplished, it's going to be what last. T-shirts, T-shirt designs, get them all ready, so I can go there tomorrow. I said there's one place might even be open today. I might check it out today. That would be something. If I could hand that in today, get it started, pay it, go to bed tonight, and the T-shirts are in production, uh, that would be great. But I'm not going to count on it. doing what I can, things I know, and uh, calculated, precise, plotted plans for everything and anything else. Got a plan. Proper planning prevents piss poor performance. And that will end segment one. Hello world. Father son up there. Big head plane. Noisy big head plane. Just kidding. Just kidding. Weasels. Alright. Hello everyone. Good Sunday evening to you. As I speak, time of day is 18.30 hours. 18.30 hours exact. It's Sunday, August 27th, I believe. And my name is Jason. That's the one they gave me anyway. And they gave me. Can't say I like it that much. Alright. Alright, I'm getting ready to go do an incredibly uh, difficult, easy feat. It's a feat that uh, is easy. In theory, in reality, just looking at it. Oh! You have to do that? No, that's easy. That's why I'm looking at it like one way, one dimension way. Yes, if it was a completely empty, hollow world and no one was there and you could just go and do it and get it, yes, that's easy, but no. There can be any number of jokers on the way here to there. You know, I'm just saying, you don't, you know, you don't, I don't take it for granted anyway. I, I know almost every other single person does. And they all look at me and go, oh, you know, you're paranoid. You know, you're, they say I'm paranoid. I say, they say I'm paranoid. Well, no, I'm not paranoid. I'm not paranoid. You're fucking paranoid. <laughs> I'm prepared. Say that. I'm not paranoid. It's a good Sunday overall so far. You know, a peaceful, peaceful day with myself. I, you know, did my best as usual to uh, distance myself from that fucking phone and. 
people strings that are attached to it. You know, I, I, I don't like the idea of people just being able to ring me out of the blue like a string and pull it and whatever I'm doing in my world. <laughs> Stop what I'm doing. Drop what I'm doing. Oh, let me go be of service. Uh, hello? Yes? Yes, hello, friend. How can I... <laughs> Uh, you get the point, you know, yes, I'm exaggerating a little bit, but I have to, to get these points across. And it's also fun. It's very fun. Talking like that, exaggerated, and, uh, taking big, you know, gratuitous swipes at large chunks of people. Alright, so what I gotta do is... <laughs> Eat and go again for the second week in a row. Pick up my mother and bring her to the shop, right? And walk around with her while she gets her list. Well, this time I'm getting some things I need. I'm double, you know, fuck them there. You know, what? I do that, come home, and then go there again, you know. So I'm gonna go shop in a foreign shop right myself today, but bring her again like I did last week, and I have to deal with my mother. Uh, not anything, uh, you know, like I hate her or nothing, but sometimes we just, just you know, she knows how to push my buttons sometimes, you know, but certain things, words, whatever, and I don't like that. <laughs> so, but we're getting better now at, uh, you know, when we're around each other, not, uh, I guess so much because I guess I do it too without realizing it or something. <laughs> you know, it's always when you, if not always, but if you admit to something that you're doing, but if you say it like I just said it, well, I must do it without realizing it or I must have been subconscious or anything like that. What that really is is complete bullshit and it's a, a non confession, it means nothing because they're not taking responsibility for it, they're just dressing it up with semantics and words. And they can feel good, so it appears that they're like sorry and stuff, but no, they're not. Uh, because of the, you, you wouldn't, you don't say it like that. You don't format it like that. If it's the other, the real way, right? So right off the bat, anything other than the real response, you know, is suspect. And you know, they're either stupid, extremely foolish, or they're, you know, like. Uh, Machiavellian, uh, like cunning, you know, they're, they're after something bad, you know. I lost for the fuckers. Alright, so, had a nice day with myself pretty much. Got some good thinking done. Went for a nice long walk before it was nice out. Uh, got to uh, catch up on some uh, little other odds and ends, like chores, like not chores, but little uh, like uh, projects of mine. I have many, many problems, but you know, they all get done in their own process. If they get done, if they're worthy of getting done. But uh, I just took a shower a few minutes ago. So I'm going up, like I said, the shop right to bring my mom. And I'm on the verge of fully, completely sweating again. That's alright. Just take another shower. No gym tonight. That sucks. See, why can't the kids play without screaming? Once in a while, you yeah, scream, but not as the uh, constant communication tone. You know, get the kids just fucking chewing on a fire hydrant. Retracting something I'm about to say, and, and they're, they're always all wrong and stupid. I'm glad that I'm now learning to do that before I say shit, and then rather where I used to say it and then have to take it back or whatever, or just deal with the problems that caused. 
because I let it fly out of my mouth like an undisciplined uh, person. So, all right, I'm just now, I, I'm talking and I'm stalling because I know when I stop, I gotta go. And for some reason, it still annoys me. You know, I know it's a good thing I'm doing, but it annoys me. I, I'd like to be on my time. All right, goodbye. Telling myself now. Why? It's so embarrassing, but it's funny, I'll tell you, like I tell everything. <sighs> right before I came down here, I had on the counter upstairs in the kitchen a box of unopened Mike and Ike's, the green box, the regular ones, the first ones, the best ones. I got some pizza heating up in the oven. But I stupidly opened the pack, took a handful, left the box upstairs, came down here, set this up, turned it on, ate them before it started. Now all I can think about is how much I want that, that box and another mouthful. That psychotic sugar rush, oh my god. I'm fighting it. See, I am not going. I did not go. I don't have any Ike, Mike and Ikes in my hands anywhere on me. Believe me, if I did, they'd be eaten. So, here, up, here I am. The third segment of the day. Like I said in the first one earlier today. God, that feels like a century ago. But it was really only like five minutes ago. It really feels like. In the morning is true like huh. what is true in the morning is always false in the evening Wayne Dyer rest in peace from our ascended master Anyway, it's uh, in this third segment. Time of day is 23.05 hours. 23.05 hours. So I'm still in the day. Day of. Day of the three segment vlog. Pleased with myself on the completion of this. But anyway, uh, my, tomorrow's Monday. Time for me. It's good. Go to the gym. But, you know, you know that feeling when you talk and you say something or a bunch of things that you know you really don't mean or you're going to regret them. More likely that's what it is. You're saying, I'm going to regret it. Why am I saying it? Why am I saying that? I don't know, but I'm saying it anyway. Fuck, that's the thing that I'm out to crush and find out and kill. That little voice, whatever that is, that control that is, that mechanism that lets that happen. In those moments. Oh, gosh. Nothing like feeling like an idiot. Especially after you've done it to yourself completely. Mm, that's a nice feeling there. Gotta keep those to a minimum though, folks, you know. Gotta keep those to a minimum. And, um, just plays away. Plays away. The... Such a great stick that I found in me. It's so thick. It's like from another world or something. It's like it feels like a piece of steel. It's so solid and dense. It's unreal. Uh, even just sanding it took forever with the power sander. But anyway, where I kept this one hook here, it hooks right there in my hand, pivoting, spinning. And it's a great, great walking stick. I went on the trail hike with my girlfriend uh, a week or two ago, and uh, I thought we were getting lost, and I started panicking. And, and she's like, no, no, we're fine. We're on the, on the trail. And I'm like, no, no, that's not it. That's not it. We're going to get lost. We've got to go back. we got to go back. And I got lost once again. 
Well, sure enough, you know, I was wrong. Because our overall, I don't know what to say, which is doing better too at continually learning to keep my mouth shut more and more and more around the situations and the people that I should be doing that with. Monitoring what I say and who I say it to and how I say it. Why I say it. Right here. A little writing. I was going to read shorts, but I'm massively losing energy. The life of man upon earth is a warfare. I shall repeat. Oh, Job 7 1. The life of man upon earth is a warfare. Job 7 1. Speaks for itself. why it's so important you don't fuck yourself up <laughs> you know it's so important that you uh, become your best friend your best ally Jordan Peterson said a great uh, when he said uh, you ought to take care of yourself like like how you would take care of a, a good friend who is in the same predicament got to do it because really, look, when it comes down to it, who the fuck else is going to do it? <laughs> now you think you may have people you could depend on, but no, no, no. Uh, when the shit gets real, the going gets rough and everything like that, you can't depend on anyone but yourself. Maybe you can depend on your mate. Whether married or not, maybe. I know a big failure this weekend. Ow! Fuck. Big failure this weekend was big strength. 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 I did do the sharpening video. Why is it too? A lot of I talk to people and they think I'm I'm always so serious with them and, and, and uh, like putting them down or not putting them down but like on the spot or something. And they call me straight. Oh, time to read that ring the bell on my YouTube channel and my graphics and my million dollar setup thing and, and it flashes like the, the cool logo or the you know motto or whatever. Here's my <laughs> I'll read it for you. Reject the basic assumptions of civilization, especially the importance of material possessions. Yes, yes, that's exactly what I just said. Fuck, I got a lot to do down here to just clean up before I go upstairs. Here's my mile high room from here. And I'm at that point again where at night I reach where my legs are dead from 
But right now they're dead up to far, like, they're past my knees, up into my lower lower leg right here. <laughs> Anything uh, below my, this is all dead <laughs> right now. It's all throbbing, it's all hurting. Ow, ow, get off your feet, get off me. You're killing me, get off your feet. That's what they're like screaming at me here, all, all this stuff. Uh, and it gets to the point usually every time around this time at night, because I probably only, again, sat down all day long for a combined total of uh, not even an hour, half hour, maybe. I uh, no, I didn't even eat uh, before dinner. I got to eat. Uh, that's two meals. I can't go lower than two meals. Two meals is good. It's hard. It's good for you. Three meals, I need, you know, working out again. But so starting to hurt and creep up. And that's my signal. to stop I'm getting better at making those hard calls you know the little, those little moments that cause inertia and cause you to stop and go like are you going like should I do that should I should I should I you know whatever the first thought was you said all right it's time to stop pack up get up and go boom get up go move on it in that second not 10 seconds later or whatever it was great oh, sorry gee Just do it. Get it done. But also, I have to do task for me is I really don't like to let these go a day or two after I record them without putting them up for fear of I could delete them or something like that. Plus, I'm trying to be steady again and put stuff up at least every day. So I gotta stop this, break all this down, go upstairs, go to a uh, base level, you know. Uh, Whatever they call an Everest, you know, uh, that, that camp, you know, uh, what do they call it? The summit, you know, go to the summit there, stop in the kitchen, eat my pizza, be ready for me. <sighs> right down, go up, and then rest from there, go from there, make the rest of the hike track all the way up to my room in the tower there, here in the fortress. Try to get up there, <sighs> sit down, and then put the video together, upload it. And then really sit down and relax and uh, probably watch the video for the first time while it's on TV, on YouTube. All right, so that's it. I'm closing it now. So we're 12 minutes already. So uh, three segments. Uh, thank you for watching. Yeah, uh, appreciate it. I really do. So I appreciate the likes, the subscriptions, but. I just, uh, I, I can't, I don't, can't find it in me to ask and order people, but, you know, people right off before the video starts. Oh, all right, I need you to like, like, and follow the description, hit notification bells, or comment this, and check that, and do that, blah, blah. So annoying, you know, I don't even know fucking if I like this. Don't tell me what to do. I'll decide if I like it or not, or if I want to subscribe. I'm quite fucking aware of the fact that I can do that. On my own, I don't need you to tell me it, fucking channel head, you know. <laughs>